Well, I heard that we are going to have a corporate session next week, right. and I would like to ask you about your expressions and about your feelings about the upcoming event. It will be a very important conference. Uh, as a matter of fact, it was started by Europeans on the streets protesting against ACTA. They said mm -hmm. they refused, they rejected uh, this uh, uh, trade agreement, which as a matter of fact uh, uh, was directed to change substantial law on copyrights. Mm -hmm. And uh, we understood the time that, uh, first of all, we have to reject uh, ACTA, but then we have to, um, to, to, to define in a better way copyrights, especially in internet uh, uh, sphere in internet era and um, uh, because um, copyrights were defined well uh, before internet changed the world so yeah. in uh, material world copyrights works well but in internet uh, uh, they do not so our target is to define uh, the uh, directions uh, where this copyright um, should be changed in European Union uh, as a matter of fact, after the, um, the elections, it will be our legacy for the next term, uh, uh, our um, uh, directions uh, in which way we have to change uh, uh, the copyrights. And of course, one of the things is very clear. We have um, to decriminalize copyrights uh, for those who share content without uh, earning money. So those who share with friends, who share uh, on, on Facebook, for example, um, uh, not earning money because yeah. we believe that uh, it is impossible to penalize anybody who does it uh, in uh, uh, good intentions. Mm -hmm. uh, so um, it's, it's absolutely clear. We have to make copyrights standards uh, closer to, um, uh, to, to, to the rest of uh, um, uh, laws uh, uh, we have today. So this is your general view on the direction where the copyright should go on and this is pretty much the direction you would like to show on the event? We have to, we have to define what is possible, what is not possible. Mm -hmm. um, we have to define that, for example, if uh, I have a group of friends and uh, this group of friends is just on my Facebook, yeah. huh? the internet change uh, people's relations, uh, social relations. Uh, mm -hmm. um, uh, we can uh, um, get uh, uh, contacts with much broader group of people than before. Uh, we can have close friends uh, talking to them uh, on daily basis uh, who live in Australia, even not uh, meeting them personally at all. But still, these are the social relations. So internet changed that. So we have to make a clear situation that if somebody has friends on internet, he can share, uh, for example, internet content like I can share in Poland a book which I buy in bookshop with my friends uh, uh, whom I know. Yeah. So that is a very similar case. So we must not penalize uh, people for that. And of course it is mm. just a, a, a part of it. There are many, many others, uh, um, many, many other issues. Um, but that is just the direction. We have mm. to leave a legacy those who were confronting ACTA in European Parliament uh, from different political groups because we were divided but we won uh, finally and uh, with colleagues uh, I'm very happy to do it with Amelia Anders' daughter yeah. and uh, um, uh, Mrs. Hacke uh, from Liberals um, uh, and uh, uh, I, I, I'm very excited uh, mm. by, this, uh, by this event and I'm very eager to hear to my colleagues uh, what they would like to propose um, for next uh, uh, term of the parliament. Well, we in Amelia's office are dealing with this and putting a lot of attention to this very event. But I was quite impressed by the fact that there is going to, uh, going to be a lot of Polish NGOs like Centrum Cyfrowe, for example. Right. Do you think it's a good, a good thing or can you explain it more, for example, what, why do you think Poland should be especially interested in this event? You're right. Um, there will be a lot of uh, Polish colleagues uh, uh, from different NGOs uh, who take care on freedom in internet. Mm -hmm. um, I think that there are two reasons for that. First is that uh, Poland's role in uh, rejecting ACTA uh, was uh, undeniable uh, during uh, the whole discussion and uh, the position the Polish government, the Polish Prime Minister Donald Tusk uh, took that time um, was, uh, uh, was incredible and it was the first uh, clear rejection by the um, European uh, government. Um, but it happened also because uh, Poland has a very 
long tradition of um, fighting for liberalization, uh, for liberty, mm -hmm. and uh, because we uh, in Poland, uh, since many, many years, uh, um, understood and understand that uh, liberty is something personal and internet today mm -hmm. is the way we can express, we can share our um, different uh, content, different messages, uh, um, uh, different um, information and that is also a part of, uh, of liberty, of being, uh, of being uh, free. And uh, we have very, very competent group of mm -hmm. experts, of NGOs who uh, are mm, uh, just interested in this issue and they have a lot to say um, and a lot to, to give uh, to Europeans.